we couldn't have gotten literally or figuratively any closer to having a major disaster. Normally, there are two runways where planes land and one taxiway where planes line up to take off. But that night, one runway was closed. So the pilots thought the taxiway was the runway. Well, the pilots did have a notice to airmen, or NOTAM, that said one runway was closed on page 8 of 27. Board Chairman Robert Sumalt says the NOTAMs are too confusing to be useful for pilots. That's what NOTAMs are. They're just a bunch of garbage that nobody pays any attention to. It was about midnight on July 7th, 2017, when Air Canada Flight 759 started to land at SFO in the wrong place. Where's this guy going? He's on the taxiway. Air Canada, go around. In the go around, I count 759. In the 759, looks like you were lined up for Charlie there. Video of the event shows the Air Canada plane coming close to hitting other planes that were on the taxiway. Today, we learned just how close. The distances between aircraft was about uh, 13, 13 feet. The investigation revealed that the pilots were fatigued. They had been awake for 19 hours, and if the flight had started in the U.S., the pilots would not have been allowed to fly. And for reserve pilots to be on duty for that long is just uh, nuts. That's a technical term. So based on my airline piloting experience and based on my combined 12 years of sitting here at this dais, uh, I think I've come up with two salient points. One is, and they've already been identified, the NOTAMs. They didn't comprehend the NOTAMs that the runway 28 left was closed, and they didn't manually tune the, uh, the localizer frequency. But the NOTAMs, boy, the NOTAM system is really messed up. I can tell you that right now. And these NOTAMs, uh, there's one on here that says, uh, and by the way, they're written in some kind of language that... Uh, only a computer programmer would really understand, but the bottom line here is uh, coming out of Toronto, uh, taxiway AK, taxiway R between taxiway B and taxiway AT, between B, between taxiway B1 and taxiway R, not authorized to aircraft with wingspans greater than 214 feet. And so why is that even on there? And that's what NODAMs are. They're just a bunch of garbage that nobody pays any attention to. Remember, Hamadi and I flew down to Charlotte on the jump seat a couple of weeks ago, and uh, just pages and pages and pages of NOTAMs, including birds in the vicinity of the airport. And you ask me, when are birds ever not in the vicinity of an airport? Um, the, uh, you know, these things, if you were to read them, every one of them, you would spend at least 20 minutes going through the NOTAMs and trying to understand them.